Most of us might consider SpaceX a dull roar, a vibration in the background, a momentary interruption. Now, consider what it's like to live next door to the place, where about three months ago, amid increased pressure to ready the company's new Raptor engine, an occasional interruption became an almost nightly occurrence. You can see it here. You can hear it, but you can't feel it. Calvin Witt says to understand it, you need to. It shakes everything. I mean, my ceiling fans are just sitting there shivering. My windows are shaking and blowing in and out. Pictures are rattling on the walls. We've shown you the shaking dishes, the rattling doors. It comes without notice, and sometimes later at night than many people expect. While some call it a source of pride, a sacrifice they make to support Texas and the new race for space, others have begun to worry about their biggest investment and their greatest need. They've begun to worry about what all this roaring and shaking in the air has done to their homes. Why the worry? Well, it turns out that sound waves, which SpaceX produces in abundance, are identical to earthquake waves. That's right, I said earthquake waves. But do sound waves do identical damage? Witt says his home shows signs of the rocket testing. Have you noticed any structural problems? We've had, we got now here recently, we've, we've started to notice we have a couple cracks on our ceilings, uh, a couple cracks going down our walls. They're not too bad, but they've started to be more visible as these tests have gotten harder and harder. Do you worry they're shaking your house apart? Texas A&M professor Ben Dewan says, despite their similarities, sound waves may not be the problem here. I want to say sound maker waves include one type of wave, which is uh, similar or same as sound wave, but uh, uh, this uh, type of sound wave does not really cause much damage. As I reported earlier, the troubles began in November of last year with the departure of three key SpaceX executives followed by founder Elon Musk calling the Raptor program a disaster that threatened the company's existence. Oh! That brought many more nights like this to people who live around the testing ground that borders both McLennan and Coryell counties. Home Some like Witt and even McGregor Mayor Jim Herring say they want to support SpaceX, but SpaceX needs to remember it has neighbors. It's kind of annoying. I mean, I understand everybody has a job to do. Everybody, you know, you want to test and do, you know, make sure that whatever they're doing for space, NASA, whatever the case is, it it just gets a little much sometimes. And since the stepped up testing has continued, it's brought new worries. The noise coming from SpaceX may carry with it hidden dangers. In depth at SpaceX, Dennis Turner, 25 News. We again asked SpaceX about what, if anything, they have done to mitigate the noise from the testing. We're still waiting to hear back.